Hi everyone, Alex here, AMRC, and I have the beautiful E-Flight V22 Osprey. Let's try and get this in the air. Hopefully it will be a good flight. Let's go. So in hover mode, the nacelles move forward, a bit backward, but that's not really recommended. Or when you yaw, they twist in opposite directions. And I don't usually hover this that much. I'd rather fly it, but I have two battery packs today. So let's see. There it goes. stay off the road just in case any car comes it's pretty darn stable there's just a bit of wind and yeah, I keep watching my buddy George R.A. Renfield on YouTube flying his helicopters and I'm itching to get one. That will probably happen soon, but I remembered, hey, I have this. It's also basically a helicopter. If you want it. I think the hovering does use a lot more juice than forward flight. there's one extra motor spinning in the tail but let's give it a whirl let me point it into the wind and there it is it's a fast little thing and it needs to be fast those short stubby wings Ooh, just two minutes on the timer let me see if I can get it close full throttle there it goes hope you guys can see it I'll probably try to zoom in I mostly only fly it in the stabilized mode just sort of safe they don't call it safe but it's like safe it doesn't let you flip it over or roll it and that's because I've got it in trouble with it I'm trying to fool around it's not a acrobatic plane okay we have a car coming I'm trying to bring it lower And then I'll go for a hover landing. Okay, let's see. And there it goes. Okay, road is clear. 30 seconds on the timer. I have it set to 4 minutes because these batteries are kind of old. Whoa, that was bouncy. Okay. Let me show you a bit of a transition action. There it goes. And that's about it. Now, the ailerons, the elevator is activated. No rudders, but I think it has differential thrust. And that might be just in the acro mode. 
Let me see. Yeah. Agility. Okay. Yeah, I've tried uh, taking off like a normal plane, but it didn't really work out because it wasn't tracking straight. And it takes a while with these stubby wings, as you've seen, to uh, get left. Okay, let me swap out the battery and try flying this some more. Okay. Now I'm gonna try a rolling takeoff this time. Just push forward, so the cells tilt, and give it some throttle. That's a bit more realistic. Come here, boy. Come on. Come closer. These nice people can see you and all your beauty. Yeah, it's an amazing aircraft, both in real life and model form. I know this was plagued by a lot of problems, that's why Horizon got rid of them, but I can't say I've had issues with mine other than ones I've caused horsing around and I also got this when I was fairly new to flying so I think I had a couple of champs and uh, my big three the time I've got this so and this uh, this thing is really fast and the turns are really wide this uh, stability mode two minutes on the timer Let's try another fast flyby. Let's see. There she goes. I'm itching to take it out of the stability mode, but I won't. <laughs> I do have a spare for this. Because after I crashed it, I knew I would need some spares. I lost a few parts when I crashed it. But luckily, after I ordered the second one, I was able to go back and find the parts. So that one is mostly intact. Okay, one more fast pass. And okay, let me bring it down lower so I can see what it's doing. Yeah, sorry, it's so far out, guys, but okay, there it is. Have a car coming. It does have a safety feature when it reaches a certain voltage it automatically transitions to hovering thirty seconds remaining but this battery is a bit newer so I think I can fool around with it a bit more Let me try and bring it closer.
got a card coming so maybe it will the battery will last until it passes if not I'll just keep it over there I'll land on the ground and you really suggest not flying this backwards for obvious reasons because it's not just the helicopter or drone okay and it seems clear now let's see maybe I can get a more graceful landing this time Okay, that was almost perfect. Ah, see, low battery, it won't uh, transition anymore. <laughs> I was planning to taxi it back, but hey, what a great little airplane. It gets the heart pumping every time, I'll be honest. Really, really love this one. If you have one, I hope you fly it and enjoy it. If not, uh, Banana Hobby, I think, still has one. And they are actually made by the same manufacturer in China, so it should be pretty similar. I did uh, replace the servos for uh, the nacelles on this one because they are plastic geared. And I think that may have caused issues to others. It has a regular size, regular type servos, and they're a bit smaller because it's a small model. It's smaller than most UMX planes. But yeah, it was uh, great flying it today. Hope you enjoyed it. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to leave some great comments, any questions if you have. Like the video if you enjoyed it. Subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye.